Right guys, welcome back to Son of Scotland 90, bringing you some WWE 2K15 AJ Styles My Career Mode. We've got our second competitive match on the NXT brand, we're up against this guy Tommy Wall. We know all about him. We've defeated him numerous times in the Performance Centre. But will we get the win when it really matters? Because we defeated El Herendo in the Performance Centre. But last week, sadly, he kicked our ass. We weren't the phenomenal one last week, hopefully we can be the phenomenal one this week. Let's get straight into the action guys, because we don't want to be stuck in NXT, we want to move to Raw, we want to be kicking John Cena's ass, we want to be kicking Roman Reigns' ass, all those jobbers we need talent, we want to be showing them up, and we're not going to be doing that wrestling in this wee pile of shit against creative people, even though my guy's technically a creative person, you get my drift, you get the point, so let's get stuck in and let's defeat this big steroid freak. Right That's a hard right hand there. Right into the rib cage. Oh, oh, what and a shot. To the mid what a fierce kick. No, not again. Watch the phenom. Watch out. Double act handle smash. We go for a game, but no, he's, he's punched us right in the mid section. We fall from the middle of the elbow there, right to the leg. AJ there, Russian leg sweep. A textbook reverse. Tommy Wall there, powerful legs, just pushing his back and oh, nice tornado DDT. You hear how his leg connected? Knocked into the middle of next. Big right hand there, and another. Just missed that one. And then inside Seguri, come on guys, we're, we're, we're picking up momentum now, we're, we're putting that loss behind us for last week. But big Tommy Wall there, he goes behind and nails a big German suplex, that could be a match changer there. No, we've managed to come back straight away there. And look at that big powerful Irish whip, we go back first right into the turnbuckle. But there we managed to reverse it into the Russian leg sweep. Big drop kick. A beating. And back suplex. It's gonna take another chance. Stringing a few good moves here together. He oh, now goes to the that middle that rope and he nails a splash from the top. Quick cover. This could do it actually. It ah, it's only a. Knight just got the two there. And you know, Tommy Wall, another Irish whip. Definitely got the strength advantage over us, sadly. What's gonna happen now? And he hits the but I think we've got the advantage in every other category, and there's a nice drop kick. He was able to reverse that. Oh, what a close oh and a huge right hand there. Boy, Texas man, we've just been KO'd. Talk about a big show KO punch, man. That one just decked us. Take his clean out. And there's the referee. Falls it, everyone's going down, everyone's been KO'd. AJ now brings Wall into the middle of the ring. Look at that big vertical suplex. Who's going to be first to their feet? AJ going to go for the cover, I think. No, he's not going to go for the cover because Wall's beat him to his feet. How the hell's that happened? The kick connects. Only dragging us into the centre of the ring. And he smashes our knee right off the canvas. A shot kick. There's a drop kick there. Down he goes. Boy, he was able to reverse it and get out of that. And he belly to belly suplex. Overhead belly to belly. What a manoeuvre there. He's got him up. Scoop oh, slam. Doing whatever it takes to win. A There's a hard time splash from the middle the rope. We send him into the corner now. And could be risky. 
Neck breaker off the top. And here we go, we're going to go for the calf killer and we've locked it in. Will Tommy will get at this one, I'm not quite sure. Well he's going to overpower us there but the damage could be done. He managed to get him over. Nice kicked out there. Resilient shown by Big Tommy. Doing whatever it takes to win. Now a double axe handle smash there but from us and Big Tommy there power away. Irish whip away his own and went to the outside perhaps but no. There we go, Tommy there coming. I know, we wish we could do a springboard, we should be able to, but sadly, this game has no faith in AJ, so it's limited this to basically have him just to come into the ring and do a shit move, probably. Big right hand there. And another right hand, and what are we setting him up for? Top rope arm drag. Tommy though, the first he's with the... God man, these moves are so boring. Why can't I have my full move set? Why is AJ moving like a fucking Kali? I'm moving like Kali and Henry combined. I don't understand this, it's not fair. Where's the realism guys anyway? We've we'll smashed him into the rope again. And can we finish it this time? Playing my games. Yeah, a little intimidation there. He was one step ahead on that Tommy one. Waldo. Oh no! He scored. Double well, axe handle smash. When you go high risk, you crash and burn. And sometimes you knock it out of the A big leg drop. And that was a perfect example of hitting it big. But here we go. It's AJ and he does the spin out setting. Power bomb and this could do it. This should do it. One, two. two. Oh my Christ me man, what the hell? What the feeding this guy? He's just kicking out everything. Just spinning tornado DDT and now hopefully can we deliver something here? Oh there you go, Tommy Wall, as per usual with the reversal. Oh, we've made a reversal of our own. Went for the insecurity, got reversed again. No, not again. He's putting those educated feet to good use. Moving on pure instinct now. It's back and forth all night. Tommy Wall now is relentless, just smashing us away here. And a huge spine buster there. Into the cover. We're going to lose two weeks in a row, no, we managed to. Power it there. Fan of NXT. I think it's a great way to introduce the WWE Universe to the next generation of WWE superstars. Tommy Wall went on a big back suplex. And, delivers a lot of impact. and he goes for the cover. Once the game we managed to kick out. Look past the ring at the thousands and thousands of WWE fans in attendance. Each we've managed to lock it in again. The calf killer. And Tommy Wall, this time there's no option to kick out, I mean to tap out even, and we've managed to pick up the first win on NXT guys, we've well, done it, we're going to the top, we're going to call it Big John, the leader of the CNA Nation, because we're going to smash him, we're going to call it the Undertaker, we want to take out Mania guys, we want to put the second dent in the streak, and I believe we can do it. Oh, it's, it's a better match than the first one anyway, that's for sure. At least we've managed to win this one. Hopefully we can face some real guys in a moment. Sick of facing these generic, created characters. And there you go, apparently. It was a five-star match. I wouldn't quite call it that, to be honest. But it is what it is, and we're up to 2,000 social media followers, so happy days. There, uh, Regal thinks we're better than... 
You're better than he thought he was, so you know, that's something. I wonder who our third match will be against. Let's get straight into this and find out. It's against Seuss Tucker, and he looks a bit like a Raven ripoff of him, being completely honest. But we're not going to underestimate him because he might be good. Hopefully, he doesn't nail us with the even flow DDT. Oh no, his face looks like Raven, but he certainly looks like half Raven, half Eric Ronan or something. He's a pretty big guy. Can't take this guy lightly. Doesn't really look like a, a champion material, but who knows. There you go, guys. That's what we need to do. Work on the leg for that calf killer. Oh, and Seuss Tucker there. Look at the power of him. And then he just delivers a huge right hand. There's the reversal. We need to keep... Keep working on this big guy. We've missed the insecurity there. And there's the reversal. Spinning tornado DDT. We're, we're all over him at the moment. Keeping up this momentum. Working on the legs. A big right hand, it doesn't even phase him, and look at that! A huge headbutt by the big man. That headbutt could do it. <laughs> could be knocked out cold here, no, he just stands on top of us, crushes our chest. And a big backbreaker. Hits away, man. Clawing away with those big heavy blows to the head. And this guy's a machine. He's like, holy shit! Did you see how far we went up in the sky there, man? Almost flew out the arena. Looking, looks like we had a couple of cans of Red Bull there, because for moments, we several seconds there, we did have wings. But there it goes. So it's took it there. Fire to the outside. Thing can get dangerous out here, guys. Who knows what's going to happen? Big DDT on the floor. And I can't even do a. I can't even leap oh, off the apron. That's pathetic. Like the I'm smashing that leg there off the floor. Just keep working on this leg. Well, he was able to and it's imperative he gets back in the ring right now. With DDT. DDT. Eight. We've got the Boston Crab Lock then. There it is, the Boston Crab. Oh Where's it? Eight, though. So we better get in here. This guy's not going to make it. Holy it's shit, the big man's been counted out. Not the way I wanted to win, but a win's a win. Look at that, we decapacitated him there on the outside, nearly broke his back. His legs almost fell off, Kevin Nash style. And we've picked up our second win, guys. Two wins back to back. That NXT Championship could be coming home to us. I think we've got to be the we've got to be the favourites to get the number one contender. We've what picked up two wins. What's William Regal got to say about it? Still 2,000 social media followers. Doesn't look like Regal's got much to say actually. He's not really, he's not popped up yet. Maybe he's a reunification. Maybe he's dead. Maybe he's been attacked backstage, who knows. There you go, with my to defeat. Sus Tucker, or Sus Tucker. Whatever you want to call this guys. And anyway, there you go, I don't know if we're a heel or a face. I don't think we've actually really made a movement yet to it, but I think we're banging in the middle. So anyway guys, that's going to do it for this episode. Hopefully in our next episode we get our last match out of the, the four that Regal mentioned, and then 
we should be number one contender for the NXT Championship and we will defeat whoever that is against, I can guarantee you that. We are the phenomenal one AJ Styles. I've been Sarah Scotland 90. Until next time, please like, subscribe, all that nonsense, and peace.